Hi, welcome to my channel. Today I have the Vicks Germ-Free Cool Moisture Humidifier. It says kills up to 99.9% .9 of bacteria, mold, fungus, and viruses in the water. Better breathing and more comfortable sleep for everyday comfort. Um, this is cooling. This is for a large room size. It's up to 24 hours and has a one gallon capacity. So let's get this open. Vicks Germ-Free Cool Moisture Humidifier. And it comes with a $5 off coupon. And it comes with these two. And here is our use and care manual. And the quick start guide. Says, enjoy your free Vic scent pad sample and clothes. So here's a sample. The scent pad. And it has some tape here to remove. And the tape on the back side. And the other two sides. So all four sides have some tape that needs removed. lifts off. There's the inside of it. Here's your filter. And let's see here. Okay. And you turn this to unlock it. There's a little thing here. It shows lock and unlock. And you turn this to fill it up. Okay, so I put some water in it. And I plugged it in so you'll be able to hear it, or see it, whatever. So here is our power. This says bulb, change bulb. So I guess um, something will light up for to change a bulb. And we have three of the settings. So you can hear that. Put it a little closer. Okay, here's the inside. Now, after you run it a little while, and you are supposed to get this wet before you install it, but after you run it a little while, water does get inside of here, and the, this filter does get wet. You can see here. So, if you, like, pick it up, make sure you pick it up so and keep it flat, or else it'll... The water can leak out up here if you tip it, because the water is down in here, and it'll come out these vents if you tip it. And then over here... I can't tip it too much because the water is where your UV light is. So on the front, it'll tell you when it's out. It'll tell you right here. So it says, fill up the tank, soak your filter in cool water, but not to ring it. Then insert the filter into the unit by folding it in half. You can see here that it's in half. And then you just put this right on like so. And you have three settings. High, medium, high, medium, and low. And low is supposed to be for nighttime, so it's a lot quieter. So you can barely hear that. So that's for sleeping. 
And then the VIX pad goes right in here and there's a little slot here and this is where the scent comes out. I don't know if I can tip that if the water will come out. All right, let's just pick the camera up. So right here is the slot. And this is the VIX pad. I'm gonna put it in and it contains eucalyptus oil, menthol, glycol, cedar leaf oil, and others. That's what it says. So just rip this open. Pull it out and put it in. And it is strong. It smells good. I love that scent. But it does get on your fingers, so you might want to try to hold it and put it in with the package if you can. I don't know if you can, but it's an option. Otherwise, you just have to wash your hands. So let's put it on. It says the Vicks scent pads work with heat to gradually release soothing aromatic vapors. Um, not, re not recommended for infants under 10 pounds and for children between 10 and 22 pounds. Do not use more than two pads in a 24 hour period. And as long as the humidifier is on, the scent pad heater will also be activated and that can become warm to the touch. Okay, it says the filters should be changed every one to three months depending on your water quality. Keep in mind, depending on your water quality, mineral deposits can still clog or discolor the filter, affecting its life and that of the humidifier. So that is the Vicks Germ Free. And there's the quiet mode and it really is very quiet. I'm going to turn that off. And one more thing, when you empty it, you want to, it says right here, pour it from this corner because all the water will come out this vent otherwise and it could probably mess things up. But you want to make sure you pour it out this way. So that is it. That's the VIX Germ Free Cool Moisture Humidifier. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments. Thanks so much for stopping by.